Okay, welcome back to the channel, Diecast Carousel. Uh, we've got a new episode today on uh, Sunday, the Daylight Savings Time edition of the Carousel, because we made a quick run to get some things needed at the grocery store. And uh, I know yesterday I found a lot of main lines, and I didn't, you know, have time to open any of those items. I have some duplicates that I can and want to open and show you today, along with some other items I found at the Kroger. Um, yes, uh, so I knew that it was going to be there, and we found at least the majority of the set. And then a couple of cool other items as well on the turntable as we want to show you uh, some of the items that we found yesterday. We can open some of those up and some of the items today uh, shall remain carded for now. So let's take a look at what I found. And right off the bat, you can see there they are. There they are. There they are. There they are. And it has landed in... And there we go. So yeah, we found the Vintage Racing Club. Um, we've got four out of the six. One, two, three, and four. Uh, we're missing, I am missing the uh, Porsche and the 67 Camaro. So we're going to be on the hunt for those uh, later down the road. Very, very soon. Hopefully we can get a hold of those somehow, some way. Maybe even find them out there. Who knows? But uh, let's take a close look. And we've got a couple items on the turntable. And I want to open up some other items as well. So let's begin to show you these up close. Um, so this will be number one of the Vintage Racing Club set. There is the 1954 Mercedes-Benz 300 SL. Uh, welcome addition to my Mercedes collection. I uh, have a whole lot of loose ones. And there's your set of this Vintage Racing Club. As I mentioned, I'm missing that one. And then the Camaro. These two right here. Yeah, we're going to get a hold of them sometime, some way. But this is your card. And let me know if you agree with me. Um, I really believe that these are are really hard to find and to get a hold of. We're just lucky enough to get these. These are the last ones on the pegs today at the store. People are grabbing them up. So if you can find more than one, yes, you can have some openers or duplicates for loose and take a look at them. But for me right now, these will remain carded. So let's put this one aside and we'll show the Corvette up close as those other ones fall down nice blue color tan interior metal base by the way metal base by the way on the mercedes so this is really cool uh so somewhere in between a mainline and a premium and there's your number five numeral racing stripes your front end and what a beautiful car that is uh, let's see, the three of the set will be your BMW 2002. Iconic little piece of history on this car. I love this model. You got your vintage five spokes. Uh, I do believe that this is a metal base as well. So there, that's a win. There's your card. And this still will, will remain in the package. We can see the blue and red racing stripes on the car and one more time there and then the last one is the Lamborghini Miura the 1971 Miura SV in gold <coughs> excuse me and there is your card nice gold paint job with the white the what is this a gray bottom gray piece and then a Gold plastic base. Number 32 numeral on the car. And there's your top. And this shall remain carded as well. Now I want to compare something to this one. And oh yeah, take a look. 
it shares the same wheels as the uh, the Ford GT40. Same wheels on the Women of Fast. So we will open this one up today. It is a duplicate. And I, I thought in my mind, all right, I saw the one yesterday. This one. And I'm like, does this have the same wheels as the Lamborghini? And upon the further inspection, same set of wheels. So there's some interesting information on that. So, now, let's take a look at some openers. And we'll put it on the carousel. We'll move these babies aside and keep them carted safe and sound somewhere in the diecast carousel room. There they are. All right, they're set aside for now. Uh, so let's see. Uh-huh. So let's put the matchbox over here and we will go ahead and start opening some cars. And here is the one I want to add to my GT40 loose collection and open this one up and inspect further. And there we go. There it is on the turntable. Bye, Ben. Say hello, Ben. Bye, Ben. Bye-bye, Ben. This is Ben, by the way. <laughs> ben is my nice little holder for some carded uh, items. He says, be happy. Be happy. Yep. He looks like he's happy, don't it? So, that was a good, good uh, little find real quick out there in the wild. So let's take a further look at this one now. Okay, as I'm opening it up, now this one has a plastic base. This is plastic. Uh, you got the blue and then the white racing stripes on it. Ford GT40, there's a front end. These are good rollers, of course, you can see that from that perspective. And then your rear end on it. A uh, beautiful piece. What a beautiful car. Look at that. Boom. So there's that one. Uh, the next one I want to open up. Um, let's take a look at the Leap Year Dodge Charger. Or the Roger Dodger. <laughs> Dodge Charger. Uh, so there we are. We have the card. We'll open this one up. And there we have it. Look at the colors. Look how awesome that looks. Very, very nice color patterns and combinations on this particular item model. Uh, the engine, yeah, it's orange and plastic and the pipes coming out, but that's okay. You've got your gray wheels, chrome plastic base, and number 29 numeral on the Roger Dodger and on the roof. And there's your front end. Classic casting goes right behind a classic racing mobile. All right. Uh, next, we want to open the 78 Dodge Lil Red Express truck. Since we've got a duplicate, this will be open today. And I'm excited to release it from its card. Let's take a look at this one. And there you have it. Oh my God, look at the colors on this one. Nice, nice, nice gold and the little red express emblem on the doors, gold wheels, got a plastic chrome base, the pipes on the side, behind the cab. There's your front end, old Dodge truck. Oh my God, look at that, it's so beautiful. There's your bed. And then your rear end as it goes on the carousel. Right behind the Roger Dodger. Next, we want to open up the 55 Chevy Bel Air Gasser, the collector. So I got a duplicate. So we're going to go ahead and open this one up. And there we have your model all in its beautiful glory. Nice orange, white and black livery, the collector. 
You can see the sponsors on the gasser there, your Hot Wheels logo on top, your engine and chrome front end, your classic 55 Belair gasser model. You got the Steelys, the, the chrome rim, black. And there's your rear end, black plastic base. One more time for the side and enjoy the model on the carousel. All right, so there's your openers for those. Uh, we're gonna open up next the duplicated uh, Fate of the Furious Ice Charger. Ice Charger here. There's your card and we'll release it from its package. And there's your model. Pretty cool looking casting there. Yes. A matte gray with some with some uh, bullet holes, I guess, on the hood. There's your front end, a little charger. There's your wheel spin. Got your gray plastic base and your engine and rear end on the back and then your hot wheels has a hot wheels logo on the roof one more time for the model nice very nice so we'll put it right there so there's your first set of cars going spinning around the carousel we'll give it a moment we're on the move we're on the move we're on the move for the next model to show you which is a duplicate of the Impreza. Subaru Impreza WRX in the Easter set. Uh, like I said, I only wanted to get this one out of that set. If you're looking for that, there are plenty of them out there. I'm quite sure you'll be able to find these, not a problem. But at least I wanted to get this one. So we'll open it up. And there is your model in a gray enamel with the uh, pastel, the pink, uh, blue, and then your black with the numeral, nu three numeral on it. Uh, there's your top view of this model. Pink interior, there's your front end, no details. Kind of like a mystery model to me, looks like it would be. There's your rear end with the wing, another side view. Off color sets on the rims and your black plastic base. So we'll go ahead and take this one off and put it to the side and then replace it with that one. Uh, next, the one I wanted to show you is uh, I did capture at least one piece of this Boulevard set out there on yesterday, which is the 67 Ford Anglia Racer. Uh, with a 67 emblem, numeral emblem racing on the door and on the hood. And there's your model. I uh, quite feel like I want to keep this in the card and put this near the other carded pieces that I have of this Boulevard set. So we'll just put it aside here and enjoy it in the background. And there we go. Uh, let's see what's next. What is next? Uh, let's show you... Let's show the BMW 507 in the yellow one that we found yesterday in the convertible. This model with the uh, 822 numeral on the car, on the door, and in on the hood. And it is your Hot Wheel HW Roadsters. We'll go ahead and open this one up. And then here is your model. This is the new variation of this one. I did find the other ones. Did not find the Super Treasure Hunt of C Case. So here you go. There's your chrome metal base, your rear end, your windscreen. There's your wheels. And then one more time for the front end. And there's your details on the hood. So we'll go ahead and remove the Dodge chart, Roger Dodger, and put it behind that Impreza, and put it aside for now. 
Uh, next, what shall we show you? Uh, we'll go ahead and do the mod rod. We'll open this one up. Uh huh. It is the art cars. Pretty cool little model. I like that one. So I picked it up. What a combination of things going on on this one. Boy, it is pretty cool. It catches the eye, the gold, white, orange, the silver metallic with the art. Hot Wheels logo on the side. There's your rear end. Orange plastic base. And then one more time, one more time for the side view. And the top view. And there's your front end. Wow. Very nice. We'll put the little red express aside for now and put this one behind the BMW. Uh, let's see, next we want to open the GT Scorcher. Let's take a look at that one. And I really like the color combination on it and that's what, that's what caught my eye, the, the scheme, the paint scheme. The numeral seven on the side, GT Scorcher by name, and there's your design on top and on the hood, and it has a functional piece. It goes up and down. There you go, we'll put it up. On the track, I'm sure it will be pretty fast. There's your front end. Nice spinning wheel, offset wheels. Your wing and your rear end. There's your top view from that. And one more time for the side. It looks like it's got a white plastic base. There's your model. And we'll replace it with from the 55 Bel Air Guesser and put it on the carousel and let it spin. All right, we're moving along. Thanks for uh, sticking by. And through the, we're almost through. Uh, halfway here, we got the... 67 Camaro in the art cars. I uh, wanted to open this one up. Uh, yeah, this is a pretty cool piece. We'll release it from its package since we got a duplicate. And there you go. Look at that model. Oh, yes, very nice. Front end, let your wheel spin, white wheels with the five spokes. You got your gray plastic base. Chrome pipes, rear end, there's your top view, has an R on it, there's your design, the side design is really, really cool, and then one more time for your front end, the classic C67 Camaro, and we will replace it here, and put it on the carousel, and let it spin, let's go, let's go, what a beautiful day to enjoy these cool cool models i really love showing you these thanks for joining me next we've got the 87 audi quattro in red new for 2024 let's open it up and release it from its captivity and there it is in a brilliant red look at that it's got the audi logo and the hot wheels at the rear end you got your 10 spokes, chrome, your front end, detailed very nicely. There's your top view. There's your wheel spin, how beautiful, Pla black plastic base. And then there's your rear end. And one more time for the side view. Look at that. Oh, so we'll place that one here and let it join the spinning ones for now. Uh, next, we want to do the Glory Chaser. And the 32 numeral on the car. Uh, there's your top view and there's your card. And we'll open it up. So we've got this variation to add now. I think I missed out on the treasure hunt. Or the super treasure hunt, if there was one. Yeah, there was the Gulf one. And this is your orange variation. There's your front end. I really like this casting. It is very sleek and very, very nicely done. I mean, I love it. I will add this to my collection for real. This is easy choice. Black plastic base. One more time for the side view. 
What a lean, small, clear, just crisp looking vehicle. Ah, love it. So let's replace it with the, this one and put it on the carousel and let it spin. Uh, next we've got the DeLorean Alpha. Alphas. Well, this is the DeLorean Alpha 5. Green speed. And there's your card. We'll go ahead and open it up. And there is your model in all its beauty. Got those type of wheels on it. Just a classic clean design model DeLorean. This is a new model. Very cool electric vehicle. There's your side view, black plastic base, and, and then your white paint. One more time for your front. There's your wheel spin. All right, move the GT Scorcher out of the way. We'll move these scissors out of the way so I have some more room for other cars. And we'll go ahead and put this one on the carousel. Uh, next, I'm going to open up the, the 73 Jeep J10 in the K&N livery. We'll go ahead and open that one up. A truck for the scene. We're going to get some trucks coming in here in just a moment after this one too. Uh, we did the Little Red Express and now we have another truck. Which is this one. Check that one out. Very well done. Good color scheme. Just pops. Look at the paint. Look at the wheels. There's your can in parts model. Here's your front end on the Jeep truck the j10 there's your black plastic base your spare wheels in the back and there we go so we'll replace the bmw over here and we'll put it on the carousel there it goes so there was a, that one's open almost done let's see we got this one open, it's the 67 Chevy C10, Art Cars. And this was from D-Case. Got a duplicate, so I'm going to go ahead and open this one up. And there you have it on video. Look at that. Got the khaki color with the orange and black. You got your design in there on the side, Hot Wheels. Keep driving. There's your three. And then your front end on the classic C10 casting. Very popular vehicle. Orange wheels with the black inserts, black plastic base. And then your rear end. And one more time for the side view. Poof. Boom. That's awesome. Move the Audi and put it right there. Okay, what will be next? Let's open up the uh, Mercedes, the uh, mainline variation. Uh, not the Super Treasure Hunt, which I do have carded. So we'll keep this carded, of course. I said that from the last video. But at least I got this one to open and let's enjoy it for my loose Mercedes collection. And there we have your model in red enamel. There's your wheels. Very nice. There's your detailed front end. This variation is awesome. There's your rear end detailed. Black plastic base. And then one more time for the side view. Oh, how could you not want that one? That is awesome to have uh, opened. Glad to have that one. Glad to have that one. And now we've got the, since we've got a duplicate, we're going to do the 
Fast and Furious. We're going to open this one up for my G-Body collection. The Buick Grand National. Hot Wheels Decades of Fast. Fast and Furious. And there it is out of the package. Let's take a look. That comes off easily. And there's your hood. We'll put it back on the model. The hook's on there, pops back in. See if we can do it justice. Get, get it nice and on there. And there's your model. You can see it's got the Grand National. Uh, and then your side markers. You've got your front end detailed. Got your wheels. Your rear end is detailed. Black, I mean the gray plastic base on the model. There's your wheel spin and then the side view on it. And if you can see the paint, some black metallic paint. There you go. Very nice out of the package. Uh, so we'll put the Glory Chaser to the side and let it join its models on the carousel. <clears throat> uh, let's see, next we're going to open up the Pagani Zonda R. Um, go ahead and open that beautiful model up. Got a lot of openers today, and there you go. This is awesome. Look at that car out of the package, man. You know I'm happy to have this one. Got this variation now to join my loose collection. Look at those gold wheels on it, and the design, the emblem. There's your Pagani Zonda rear end. One more time for the side view. Black plastic base. And then your front end. Bam! So we'll go ahead and replace it with this one. And put it on the carousel. Alright, 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 alright. So. Uh, looks like we've got... Let's see, what do y'all want to see next? Um, I think I've got here my... I'm going to put my carded ones aside. We want to keep those in check. This is the one I promised I wanted to open. I'm going to open this one since I've got it on card from a trade in the previous episode, a couple of episodes ago. So we'll go ahead and open this one up. And there we have it, folks. There is your R33 Godzilla. There's your design, your livery on the side. Got your pearl white paint. Well, it's enamel, white enamel, I'm sorry. I thought it maybe had a little little extra. No design on the front. No details, I mean. There are your wheels. Black plastic base. And then your detailed rear end, at least. So there you go. So we'll replace it with this. And go ahead and put it on the carousel today to enjoy. How you like those? I love them. I love them. I mean, let's see. We're sorting them out. We're sorting these out here. We know the ones we want to keep and open. We got duplicated ones. <laughs> yes. Duplicated ones will keep packaged and the ones we want to open. Next, let's open up the uh, Alfa Romeo, the GTV6 3.0. Stick with me, guys. We're getting on, we're getting through it. Here is your model, the side view, gray enamel paint, 
your front end, your disc wheels, we know about those, your black plastic base, and the rear end is not detailed. And that is your sleek, sleek model to enjoy in the wheel spin. Boom. We'll put the truck over to the side and let it join its friends on the wheel. All right, are we done guys? Are we done? Are we done? I don't know. I don't think so. I don't think so. Uh, we've got the El Segundo Coupe. We'll go ahead and open it in the 68 racing livery. Nice green, teal green, teal blue, whatever you want to call it. Oh, get to add this to the variation collection. We've always been hunting these down. We grab these every time we see them because I really like this model as well. Very good job on it. There's your side view, your top, your rear end, another side view, your black plastic base, and then that's it to complete. And we'll replace it with the Mercedes near the trucks and we'll put it on the carousel. All right. Maybe it's time to just do uh, a decision here. Uh, we've got a lot of, that we have yet to open and you know, we're just going to uh, save those for another day. How about that? Uh, this video has gone on for almost 32 minutes and that's about as long as I want it to go. Uh, but we will open these up at some point at another video. But thank you for joining me, at least, you know, going through this. I at least wanted to show some of the cars I wanted to open versus the ones I wanted to keep carded. And so this is a goodbye. Thank you for joining me on this episode of Diecast Carousel. Have a good weekend of your weekend and have a great week coming up. And we will see you next time. Peace.